Welcome to Spiritual Psychic with Sarah Wiseman, where you'll learn how to unlock the secrets of spiritual intuition and your own psychic gifts. Here's Sarah. Welcome to Spiritual Psychic. I'm Sarah Wiseman. Today we're talking about how awareness, how awareness brings betterness to your life or how, how your life becomes better when you become aware. And how is this? How is this possible? How would, uh, um, you know, we, we, we do receive the idea that our attitude creates our reality. But this isn't about having an attitude, really. It's not about having a, a, a positivity or a positive approach. It's really about having a detached approach, a neutral approach. The Buddhist term might be equanimity. We just exist as we are, and we are aware only of one thing, we're aware that we're souls. So why would this awareness make your life better? I mean, why wouldn't it actually maybe make your life worse? You get, you start to not care about the human things when you're always with your head in the clouds. But here's what the book says. We're teaching from the book Messages from the Divine. When you are aware for even a moment, when you spend even a moment in consciousness, you begin to feel differently about everything. About your life, about your situation, about your circumstance, about your self. When you are in divine space, there is no shame, anger, pain, or despair. There is no need to numb yourself when you exist in the vast space of light. And we say this is how you can live all the time. So this idea that if you go into consciousness, that space where you connect with divine, you connect with the light, All of those feelings, the human feelings, again, of shame, anger, pain, fear, those aren't there anymore. And then you come back to your regular old earth life, and you do feel those again. And then you go back into divine space, and they're not there anymore. And over time, this balance of what in you is light and dark, or what in you in you is light and shadow begins to shift so that over time you yourself become a being who is more filled with light and who turns toward the light more frequently and who exists in that vibrational level and who exists with that consciousness, that awareness. You know, I had a friend tell me the other day, He was feeling that everything was so chaotic. And I said, you know, is it this idea everything's so chaotic, nothing can be controlled, it all is just happening all at once. You're driving and you start to pay attention to all the things and how could that even work? How could that even work? It's all so chaotic and uncontrolled. And I said, well, you could also look at it as everything is in flow state, which is how I choose to look at it. Everything's happening all at once. You can't control it. You can only be in it. And once you enter into that flow state where you're conscious, you, you're you living from soul perspective instead of the nitty-gritty human perspective, you don't see it as chaos or darkness. You see it as light and flow. The book continues, in what aspects of your life 
are you being asked to lean toward the light? And what if you just chose consciousness as your response instead of the customary shame and anger and pain and fear? We are working from the book, Messages from the Divine. You'll find it and me at sarahwiseman.com.